Oh, I, uh, I wanted to also remind, we talked a little bit about the uh, the Chinese balloon uh, mm-hmm. that we shot down that, we, that our president and military saved us from. Mm-hmm. Ugh. After it had left. Uh, they are, uh, they're briefing Congress today. Okay. Uh, all about the, uh, all about the balloon incident. And I hope, you know, we'll get questioned about the previous balloon incidents yeah. and how, what the hell is going on? Exactly. What are we freaking paying you for? Billions of dollars. Oh, yeah. I guess a balloon went by yesterday. Well, we yeah. missed it. But did you see, I mean, uh, we got a lot of good information from the White House on the balloon. The press asked KJP about it the other day, <laughs> and we got tons of information. So I don't know what else you need to know about the balloon, but oh. let's do clip number one here, shall we? How is it possible that this administration discovered um, at least three it's previous nice balloons that flew over the U.S. under the previous administration, but Trump officials didn't know it was happening? Yeah, so look, I think that, uh, and we have talked about this before, about how um, uh, the, when it um, when the PRC government surveillance balloons trans, uh, trans, trans, transited uh, the continental U.S. briefly at least three times, as you just mentioned, during the president's uh, prior administration, and once that we know of the beginning of this administration's, uh, but never for this duration of time, as we know, uh, this information was discovered prior to the admin administration uh, left, uh, but uh, the intelligence community, as I said, is prepared to give uh, give uh, briefings to key officials. Uh, this? But this is something, uh, this is something, sorry, post, yeah. but this is something that we, we this, they right? did not, they were not aware of, as as we've just laid out. I mean, that is, uh, China's not no, an enemy. that's the worst. No, I don't. That's the I don't, worst I don't got answer, it. and that's saying something for her. That is the worst answer she has ever uttered. I, I, no, I it don't, I don't no got it. no sense at all. I'd like to start it after when she actually does explain it. Uh-huh. I guess we could play the whole thing again, although she's agonizing. So just when she begins here with this clip, yeah, just see, know that just, she's a fashion icon. But, I like the way she dresses. She dresses great. <laughs> she does her hair great. She looks great. She's always – the color is just her. It's perfect. I love it. Yeah. Yeah. So so when you're listening to this, just sit back. Honestly, try to follow. I, when let's, she starts explaining let's about just the – sit back and listen. Of course, listen. we've just, talked about previous and prior – just let, let the thing play and try to follow what she's saying. How is it possible that this administration discovered um, at least three previous balloons that flew over the U.S. under the previous administration, but Trump officials didn't know it was happening? Yeah, so, look, I think that, uh, and we have talked about this before, about how um, uh, the, when it um, when the PRC government surveillance balloons trans, uh, trans, trans, transited uh, the continental U.S. briefly at least three times, as you just mentioned, during the president's uh, prior administration, and once that we know of the beginning of this administration's, uh, but never for this duration of time, as we know, uh, this information was discovered prior to the administration administration uh, left uh, but uh, the intelligence community as i said is prepared to give uh, give uh, briefings to key officials uh, but this is something uh, this is something sorry post yeah. but this is something that we we they did not they were not aware of as as we've just laid out I, wow I, I don't know man she tried to say that they knew before they left office and then then she the the male reporter voice you hear he's she corrected herself I'm sorry post post yes uh, we found out yeah. after or they were told after I I don't know I, it's just so much this wow. is the worst administration in the history of the nation by far she is terrible mm-hmm. and I did see a report I will say maybe it's starting to sink in a little bit because I saw a headline on a it was like I think it might have been MSNBC or uh, even NBC I don't know was an NBC logo, I think, where they were talking about uh, KJP um, being uh, not good. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that was the exact headline, but that's what it was. Not uh, good. It's not good. Not uh, good. Just KJP, not good. And by the way, <laughs> I, 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 I want to point this out just because it it was so obvious this time. Normally, it's not as obvious. I swear there is a a a, a uh, memo or whatever in that administration they are not allowed to utter the name trump well not anymore the previous administration and, but but it's always the previous administration yeah but this time she walked it right to that edge you know under president the previous administration yeah. 
Yeah, they want to say I, it. I bet you get taken out back if you mention the name Trump. It's possible. Don't you dare say his name. It's possible. I mean, I, okay, it's fine. Uh, you know, whatever. Petty. Yeah. Yeah, whatever. But uh, she is, and, and she normally at least is terrible at reading what she has in her great big book of everything. Mm-hmm. But that was just terrible. Just, I don't know. She didn't. It didn't seem like she had anything in her great book book of everything. No, the the PRC traverse to tra- trip tra- right? tra- tra- We're not calling them the. the we're I mean, not calling them China. I mean, in fairness, I couldn't say incurred upon or whatever the hell I was trying to say yesterday. What is it? What's our problem with being able to describe how a balloon flies over a country? But anyway, <laughs> <laughs> what we, anyway, so uh, yeah, uh, there you go. So look, how many I think, times? I can't wait to hear. Is this today that the balloon talks are going yeah, on? Yeah, they're supposed to brief everyone on that uh, today, and they've you know we've seen uh, we've seen but we've got the photos. Of them recovering the balloon mm. and uh, showing us, you know, what they what they recovered, mm-hmm. and so we'll see if we learn anything from it. Um, you know, it we got it was, it was a it, yeah. it's a pretty big balloon. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I mean, I I realize we make the jokes about it. You know, some kid let it go in Wuhan, and <laughs> uh, you know, it ended up flying over the U.S. But look at all that weather data. I know. That's thank you, <laughs> thank you. Uh, <laughs> But it's just incredible to me that uh, now China, you know, they, of course, we said, they, you know, they want it back. And China, China fired no. the head of the Weather Bureau about, over no. there. And he's got to be like, wait, no, come on. Oh, really? That makes no sense at all. What are you talking about? I guarantee you he's not saying that if he wants to live. Mm-hmm. No, he's lucky that he got fired. Mm-hmm. I mean, if they're saying that, man, he's, hmm? he's working at the bat market in Wuhan. So, yeah. But I'm just, it just, it puts up that whole, uh, you know, let's put up the illusion that this is a real weather balloon. So fire that guy. So they actually ran the headline that they fired the guy that's the head of their uh, yeah. balloon team. Yeah, balloon team. The bombardiers, the balloon bombardiers. Because I find that, uh, I find that difficult to believe. I mean, I'm, I, I don't, I mean, I'm sure that they said that, but I find that difficult to believe because that's not his fault i i that's the point yeah i don't but that's part what of the I mean. ruse that no he's just saying that china's yeah. just saying china that. fires weather service yeah. head amid u.s balloon fallout yeah that, that it's though. part of the ruse it's part happen. of the then it happened they're lying wait what are they lying the about? prc is lying to us oh you're saying they didn't fire the yeah, guy yeah they're lying to us <laughs> they've they were just giving us the yeah well okay we fired the guy uh-huh. leave him alone the guy had hundreds of balloons oh okay, i only know about six or seven or maybe eight or nine or ten that have been flying over the u.s and other countries all over the world a shout out to that guy in billings montana um you know who apparently runs our uh defense department oh, yeah. now uh be sure to <laughs> make us all aware when we see something no doubt cross our skies there's no kidding about that